My name is John Harrington, I'm Cabinet Member for Infrastructure and Transport on Herefordshire Council. I'm very happy about the installation today. It's something different. It has been done in other cities, in Cork and in places in parts of London and Berlin. It's something that can have an immediate effect and I'm really, really excited to see how it goes. The difference between trees and moss is that trees actually can only really convert CO2 into oxygen and they're quite good at that but actually moss can do that better. So moss can do the equivalent of about 28 beech trees work in converting CO2 to oxygen. But critically, moss actually eats pollution. So particulates, things like nitrous oxide, brake dust, that will actually be eaten by the moss, digested, and it doesn't really have a byproduct. The estimation is that about 7,000 liters of, of kind of human breathing air will be filtered in an hour. And so that's quite a lot, but it has to be quite particular to a spot. And that's what we're trying to do. We're not trying to filter the entire city, especially in a place like Hereford. We've got about three spots in the city where the pollution is particularly bad and it tends to sit in an area. So actually having a filter there will make a difference. And we think we can measure that. We have a climate emergency. We've lived through a pandemic. We know that we're going to move differently. And what we're trying to do is to get people who can move differently, move a different way. And in relation to things like alternatives, this is something that can be done very quickly. This is an instant impact. The minute we put this in, it's going to be working. And while we build on those other measures like modal shift and getting people to travel a different way and reduce traffic, work with our schools to make sure school transport is properly addressed, while that's all happening, and in Eastern Bridge, we can get things done now. For more information, visit www.herefordshire.gov.uk forward slash mossfilters.